The fill tool in Blender is a multi-purpose tool. It can be used for creating edges, creating faces, converting a selection of faces to an ingon, or even filling in a existing wireframe. So here I have three different examples of a variation of a plane. In this example, I want to fill this hole with a face. If I just press F, it will fill that with an ingon. If I press Alt F, it will fill it with triangles. Now, in this case, I have a wireframe mesh with no faces, but just vertices connected via edges. And I would like to just fill this immediately without having to go one by one and fill them. Well, ever since 2.63, Blender now has auto detection for a selection like this. And you can simply press F once and it will automatically fill it. However, as you can see, in some cases, it doesn't fill perfectly. And this is an indication that you need to sort the vertices in the mesh. Now you can do this by with your selection, hit Control V and to bring up the vert vertices menu, and you can see sort vertices. You then have several different options in which way to sort the mesh elements. And in this case, just sorting them by selected will work. And if I now hit F again, it will then fill that perfectly. The next option is if I wanted to say convert part of this to an ingon, say maybe this selection, like that, then I can simply select it, hit F, and it will convert all the selected faces to a single ingon. Now one more case, if I say delete these faces, and I want to just connect these two vertices with an edge, I can just select the two, hit F, and it will connect the two. If I select one more vertex, hit F, it will fill a triangle. Or if I happen to have, say, four vertices selected and hit F, it will fill in a face. Now, one thing it cannot do is if I have four vertices like this and hit F, what's actually going to happen is it's going to fill a face with a quad with an edge through it. But this is not actually two triangles, as you can see here. So just be aware that it will not detect if an edge is already going through the existing one, and you'll need to remove that edge instead. So again, you can select either three or four vertices and fill it, and it'll fill either a triangle or a quad. Or if you have more vertices than that selected, such as this case, then it will fill a single ingon.